What's up guys, Barry here. So today is gonna be the first day that I'm gonna be starting this tank vlog. Um, I have a Red Sea Reefer 250. I love the tank. It's, I got an all white, as you can see. And it's dead silent. The glass is super clear. So today I'm just gonna give you a rundown of all my equipment that I have on my tank. So these are my lights guys, these are two Generation 4 Radeons XR15 Pros. I have no complaints with these lights, they are very bright. They also are LEDs and they give off minimal heat. They're also connected to my Apex so I do have controllability over them. Along with the EcoSmart Live so I can control them through my phone as well. Now moving on to my power heads guys, I have two Vortex, one's an MP10, one's an MP40. They give off a lot of flow, which is something that you need if you're growing SPS especially. There is a wet and dry side, so there is no heat dispersed into the tank, which is something that I really like about these pumps. And another thing that I like is that they're dead silent. Here's my tablet guys, that's connected to my Apex. So I get full controllability over the tank right next to it if I'm working on it or anything like that. I also get the temperature, the pH, the salinity, and the ORP. Don't mind the ORP. I haven't calibrated my probe in a while, so that's off. Everything else is right. And just having that option to just control your tank from right there is great. And that's why I love the Apex. Now here is the Apex itself. This is the brains of the tank, I like to say. And... I bought this cabinet from Home Depot and I built the false wall inside of it and it just holds my apex and it also holds my reef octopus controller. I like everything to be neat and tidy and this cabinet gives me that functionality. So down in the sump guys, really not that much going on down here. Um, this is my Bubble Magus protein skimmer. This is the Curve 5. Um, it does its job. The only bad thing I could say about it is that it's kind of loud. It is the loudest thing that I have connected to my tank. But other than that, it does do its job. And it produces a lot of skim meat. So now moving on, guys. This is my BRS mini carbon reactor. I do like it for the simple fact that it's very small. And it fits perfectly under my sump. Um, I don't run it every day because my tank is very clean. And there is no need for me to run it. I would only run it if I see the tank getting kind of dirty or if, there's a, or if I move a coral and it stresses out or anything like that. That's the only time I would really run it. Other than that, I just have it there for just in case. But something I could say is that it does do a great job for cleaning the water, making the water crystal clear when it needs to be. For my return pump, I am running the Reef Octopus Various 2 return pump. It's a very powerful return pump. I'm even running it on the lowest setting possible. It's dead silent and it does its job for the tank. I have no complaints about it whatsoever. It does come with a controller that I do have mounted next to my Apex. And it's just a great pump. Now moving on to the Apex guys. I do have the Neptune Systems Apex Dose. And I have no complaints over it. I do like that it works seamlessly with the Apex itself so I can control everything on my phone. I can tell it what to dose, when to dose on my phone. I can look up on my phone also the, each time it did dose, it saves it onto the Apex. I can look to see when it dosed and how much it dosed. Um, I do dose calcium and alkalinity and I have no problems with it at all. It's a great system and keeps my tank parameters in check. Once again, guys, this is my first tank update. It would mean a lot to me if you do like and subscribe. I will be giving you guys content once a month and update you guys on what's going on with my tank. Today was just a equipment update. Next one would be probably calls and livestock. And I look forward to making another video. I look forward to having you guys with me every step of the way as I go through my tank vlog and my tank matures. Thank you guys for watching again. Peace out.